हाय आई एम डॉक्टर सुषमा दिखित वर्किंग इन क्लाउड नाइन हॉस्पिटल पटपड़गंज एज अ सीनियर कंसल्टेंट इन गाइनी एंड ऑब्सटिक्स हैबिचुअल अबॉर्शन और रिकरेंट प्रेगनेंसी लॉस आर द सेम थिंग एंड बाय डेफिनेशन वी कॉल इट हैबिचुअल अबॉर्शन व्हेन द नंबर ऑफ द अबॉर्शन आर मोर देन टू और मोर देन थ्री बाय सम गाइडलाइंस एंड इट्स इंसिडेंस इज अराउंड वन परसेंट the causes of habitual abortion are very variable like it can be genetic cause infective so there may be some structural anomaly like anatomical causes and sometimes the cause is not known even after the full investigations so if we want to prevent the incidence of habitual abortion we have to take care of the general health of mother for that the pre pregnancy counseling is very necessary that mother should come before planning the pregnancy to the gynecologist and we do check up as a whole from top to bottom we do some investigations and if there is any problem in mother we have to treat her before planning pregnancy similarly such as like increased age elderly mothers they have increased chance of habitual abortion so try to plan pregnancy in a appropriate age and if you think about the treatment of the habitual abortion it depends on the cause of the habitual abortion if the cause is infective we have to treat the infection if cause is anatomical like incompetent os or uterine septum uterine fibroid uterine polyp then we have to treat these conditions surgically and then we can decrease the chances of habitual abortion if the causes of habitual abortion is because of medical problems in mother we have to treat the medical conditions in mother like hypertension diabetes hypothyroidism hyperprolactinemia after controlling these disorders the mother should plan pregnancy and that's how we can prevent the habitual abortion similar if some genetic cause is there as a cause for habitual abortion we have different methods to remove the cause of habitual abortion to stop the further abortions in a mother